welcome to my channel. Um, today we'll be uh, looking at installing an audio mixer application for Windows 10. This works for Windows 8 as well. Uh, I'm not sure about Windows 7, but I'm sure it would. You guys can all have to try it yourselves. Um, this is called Peace. Now I didn't create this software, but it's completely free. No trial period, just download, install. And it comes with a bunch of uh, presets over here in the left hand corner. You can see we have uh, a bunch of them. And you can select from. Classic, we got dance, uh, just a whole bunch. And if you're a more advanced user, you can move the sliders up and down to adjust the sound yourself. And you can save. Uh, I'm just going to add a save. I'm just going to call it test 2. And OK. And see there, there's test 2, there's test. And you know, swatch back and forth. Between them, it's not a big deal. You can also adjust your own uh, speakers in the right hand corner there, if that's what you, you like. And so, if you like what you see, let's move on to the installation. There's two download uh, links in the description there. Uh, the first one is going to be uh, Equalizer APO. You will need both files. So, let's go to the download page here. Click download. Okay, now click on the second link in the description and uh, it's going to take us to Peace. That's the application we just saw earlier. Now, for, now my downloads automatically go to my desktop. For you guys, um, you might have to go into your uh, downloads folder, that's where Windows saves things by default. So you guys might go to downloads folder for me as the desktop. So make sure you check in there if you don't see it. So moving on, let's install Equalizer. We just want to double click, click yes, next, I agree, next, install. So when we get to the screen, you want to check mark default device, that's your main set of speakers. For you guys, you guys may have a whole big huge list of other devices, but you do want to select default device and click OK. And if you want to change your speakers later on, you can always go back into configuration.exe and then uh, reset uh, which are the speakers you want. Now, you should reboot just so it takes over your sound system, but for the sake of the video, I'm going to reboot later. I don't want to keep you guys waiting. So I'm going to finish. And from there, if you go to the start button, uh, all apps, you'll see that the Equalizer is installed and has a whole bunch of options for you guys. Uh, go into Configuration Editor and you can configure your sound in here. Now, to me, this is a little un user unfriendly. You know, I, I'm in a rush, I want presets or I want my own saves. Uh, I like to use Peace. You guys can stop there if you don't want to use Peace. But for Peace, keep going to C, Program Files, Equalizer, APO in the config folder. And uh, just take the piece and drop it right inside, and we want to open it from there. It won't work if you try to open it from the download folder. It has to uh, actually be in this folder. So there you just run it. And yes to overwrite the config text file. And you know, there's it's the simple interface and the full interface. I like using the full just because it has that, uh, that save option. And uh, I check mark don't show this again. I start up because you know I'm just gonna use that one and uh, just click on full interface. And we're right back in the beginning again uh, with the piece uh, equalizing, and you know it works just the same. Um, if you guys like my vid, please subscribe below. Um, and uh, I'll see if I can come up with some more videos for you guys. Uh, thank you very much for watching.